Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So on today's video, we are making another appetizer. This is the Italian bruschetta. And um, I know a lot of people might say I'm mispronouncing the name saying it's bruschetta, but I think it's bruschetta because I'm pretty sure like every, um, I usually hear Italian saying bruschetta and the recipes um, are usually, they, they do say it's a bruschetta. So um, I'm pretty sure it's a bruschetta if Italians say it is so, um, but anyways, uh, it is super easy, it is one of the quickest, one of the easiest appetizers to make. The flavors are amazing, I mean, you get that sweetness from the tomatoes, you get that richness from the olive oil, that cheesiness from the cheese, you get that crispiness of the toasted bread, so it is super easy, super quick, and let's show you guys how to make it. So to make this bruschetta here, we have slices of bread. Um, a little bit of basil, just a handful, a handful of cherry tomatoes. Uh, you can use just the normal red ones, but we had the colored ones around, so we'll use those. But two cloves of garlic, a little bit of uh, Italian Parmesan cheese, the grated one instead of the powdered one, that's what we're using. Salt and pepper and some olive oil. So first up, we're going to chop the basil into small um, pieces, I guess, and we're going to cut the tomatoes into half. So our first step is to grill the bread on a grill slash pan, just toast it. So it turned golden brown from uh, one edge. So once it turned golden brown from one edge, you're just gonna flip it onto the other one so that it gets golden brown on both edges. So uh, once we took them out of the, the pan, we're just gonna uh, grate some garlic on them while they're still nice and hot. So after we've grated the garlic on all of the, our slices, now we're gonna make uh, the tomato mixture. So we're going to add in our tomatoes into a bowl and we'll season it. So some salt, some pepper, we'll add in some olive oil, some basil, and we're just going to mix it all together. We're going to take the tomato mixture and we're going to pour it into the bread. So once we've added in the tomato mixture, we return it to the pan and we sprinkle some of the Parmesan cheese on top. And we're going to continue with the same method until um, we run out of the tomatoes. So now we're just going to cover the pan with whatever lid because the goal here is to just uh, get enough steam to melt the cheese. So this is what it looks like. It looks amazing, that nice golden brown color. And then it smells so good. The cheese is like melting over here. So it looks amazing. I don't think I want to touch this plate. I want to like serve it like this. But I did get a chance to try um, one that was left over from the batch I made. So. Um, it's very rich from the olive oil, the tomatoes offer a nice sweetness and freshness and then the bread is nice and crunchy from the toastiness and then the cheesiness offers um, a nice creaminess so it does all so good and um, I highly recommend trying it because it is super quick and easy to make. So this brings us to the end of today's video, I hope that you guys enjoyed it and if you like this kind of content please like, share, subscribe, comment down below and follow me on my social media so you guys can support me to make more content. I'm available on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok and Discord and even if you don't like the video just leave a dislike so you guys, um, so you guys can let me know which ones of you like my videos, which ones don't. And um, thank you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.